Uh, I think I touched on this a little bit earlier in the week is trying to get our offense to catch up to our defense, um, which we we spent uh, the days coming back from Vegas working on that and felt like we, we got ourselves better looks tonight, but we're not going to beat uh, – we're not going to be any, anybody shooting seventeen uh, percent from three um, with the volume of shots that we are taking out there. So uh, we've got to find a way to be better. Yeah, thirty-four attempts to three. Did you like that selection today? I know they weren't falling, and there were a lot of open uh, contests. Uh, I'm okay with that number. I mean, I, I felt like we were. It presented itself within the offense where we were getting decent looks in there. Um, because we weren't getting a lot of uh, offensive firepower uh, early in the game. Um, and then <clears throat> later on, we were able to kind of get the inside uh, inside part of the offense going, and then that kind of freed up some, some extra shots um, around the perimeter. But we were getting good looks, and uh, they, they certainly didn't bounce our way tonight. You know, maybe a little bit uh, discombobulated out of flow, a little bit of time down offense. Is that more just – that's a I don't I don't have an answer for that one right off the top of my head I would say a little bit of it is moving multiple people in at different positions so there there could be a little bit of confusion there as far as where they need to be but uh that's on us and hopefully we can clean that up Uh, I mean, they they need to understand, that, and we we talked about that in the locker room. That Robert Morris is is very stingy defensively. They're very well coached. Um, uh, both programs it might be the first team to forty to to win the game um, on Sunday, but uh, um, on a night like this, you got to shake it off as far as your shooting percentage goes and get back in the gym and get ready for tomorrow.